Hello my beautiful people and welcome back to the channel. Say hey! <laughs> Today, you can tell by the title already, I am so excited for. We are going to my favourite garden centre, my other favourite garden centre, and then Manchester Christmas markets. Explain a better day. I feel like this is probably actually my first Christmassy video. I've got my hair extensions in, we've got slick bun, I need to brush them. That's not a vibe. Um, but we've got slick rick and then hair extensions in, and then the little bone. It looks cute. Um, but yeah. This is what we're doing. I just thought I would introduce the video in the car. Obviously, I'm not driving, but yeah. Carry on watching to see what we get up to. But I just thought I would say, good morning. Good morning. We're here. We're here at the Hollies, my favorite place. Um, I don't know what the plan is. I don't know whether we're gonna like eat first. I've, well, we've had a banana. It's health, health is wealth. Had a banana for breakfast. Um, but yeah, this is the OOTD actually. Shall I put you on the car? Don't fall off, please. So many people just saw me do that. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna embarrass myself anymore. We're gonna go inside and I'll show you inside. Okay, you can't see me. Okay, bye, I love you. <laughs> so I did mean to show you our food, but we've ate it all and I have, this is the, honestly, it doesn't look like a lot, but this is the nicest hot chocolate ever, 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 ever. It's a Terry's chocolate orange one. So good. Did you enjoy your food? The little bit of sausage thing that Dad shared with me, yeah. Did you enjoy your food? I did, it was very nice. And then we've got this nice little view lot with the little stars. Cute! And then we're going to go check out the shop. But yeah, best hot chocolate ever. That's the exit, that's the entrance. But I just thought I would show up these Christmas trees. Is this not the best? Oh my God. And we're going in here, which is like a whole house and they just convert it, especially for Christmas. So like if you come here in the, when it's not Christmas, this basically is someone's house and it's closed. But I don't know where they, <laughs> where they live when it's Christmas time. But yeah, I'll show you what I can, but I don't wanna get, I don't wanna get other people in, but yeah. The trees are everywhere. And then this is the entrance. Look, it's literally like someone's house. Oh my God, hi. Funny seeing you here. Woo! <laughs> but yeah, it's just Christmas everywhere. How cool. <laughs> lots of Emma Bridgewater in here but look at this how freaking cute is that the little bear oh my god it's tiny little espresso okay I need to calm down but look little mince pie adorable love it but yeah look at this shot Louise is all the way over there me and Mark are here but yeah this is like the greenhouse bit now we're back say hello why do you never talk? <laughs> you just wave. Smile and wave. We're back. We've bought. Can't wait to drive. No, because I thought I'll drive this bit and then we can decide who drives the last bit. We've basically bought the whole of the shop, haven't we, Mark? We have bought quite a lot. We have. We've bought a tree, which you can see just there. Um, can I give you that up? <clears throat> We've bought some baubles. What else have we bought? Christmas lights. Christmas lights. Food. A lot. I'll do a haul. I'll do a haul. I can't do a haul now <coughs> because it's all in the boot. But I will do a haul, I promise. I normally say I'm going to do a haul and then I don't do a haul, but I'm going to do a haul. Right, now we are going to... Bent's. Bent's Garden Centre. <gasps> Bit of a weird name for a garden centre, I think. Bent's. But there we go. 
Right, so we'll see you there. <laughs> what are we saying then? Where am I going? <laughs> I've got to know, I'm into the display. Do you like it? I don't know, I've got to go down there. Yeah, but look, what's, what's the first impression? Well, I don't know yet. <laughs> it's big. <laughs> it's big. It's all the way down there, look. And all the way over here. This is Ben's. It's huge. <laughs> What do you think now? <laughs> Too much. <laughs> she's she's like a fish out of water. <laughs> I am in Christmas tree heaven and I love it. Louise is staring at me. Look. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. <laughs> There's so much. Look, I said we need to get one of these. We need to get one of them snowmen. <laughs> Look at the size of him. It's so busy here, honestly. I'm trying to not film people, but honestly, I think impossible, but it's literally like a pen of Christmas lights. Louise has bought something that looks like this. It's gonna be massive. I will show you all when it arrives, but it's huge. <laughs> it's almost the same size. It's not the same size as this. But yeah, it's like that, I think. Hey! So, we're back from, can I have my arms? I've got the Tala, the new Tala um, Gilet, but then you can unzip the arms and it becomes a puffer coat, coat and you can like zip the arms onto it. Best invention ever, don't know why they've never done it before. Um, and I love it. So, obviously we're going from like daytime to walking around a market so i'm assuming it's gonna be cold so i'm zipping my arms on and while i zip my arms on i'm gonna just thought i would update you we're now in manchester 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 and we're about to walk around the markets have you ever done the manchester markets before never 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 i've only i've only done nottingham so this will be exciting for you never done birmingham i think the birmingham markets are meant to be really big to be fair Maybe maybe that's what we do this year. We make it our mission to go to all the markets. I need to make sure I've got in the right arms on here and I do not have enough room. I think that's that arm. That looks right, doesn't it? Um, so yeah, what was your opinion quickly of Bent's? Too busy. Too busy. It was very busy in Bent's garden centre and it is normally busy to be fair. It is normally busy, but I feel like at Christmas it's just that next step up, isn't it? To be fair, I feel like it's going to be busy. These, these, these markets are going to be busy. You know that, don't you? See, look at this. You have to find the right arm. But once you find the right arm, it's so... It is, it is easy to do once you get the right arm. There you go. Um, so, yeah, I just thought I would update you. And we will catch up when we're at the garden centre. I love how you're, like, leaning out of garden the Garden centre. Oh. Um, <laughs> market. Market. Sorry. It's been a long day. It's been a long day. Yeah, we're getting a bit brain fried. I think we could have missed out Bents. Just gone hotties in here. Well, maybe so, but there you go. Every, every day's a learning day, and um, yeah, we'll see you at the markets. Bye. So, that is the top of the market because we've just walked through there and it's insanely busy. I'm not even in focus. Insanely busy, like so, 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 so busy. So, I don't actually know how much of this I'm going to be able to film because there's crowds. And I always feel awkward. I don't feel awkward filming in public, but I feel awkward of like, because I'm filming now, but I feel awkward of like trying to get other people in it, like who don't want to be in it. I mean, that's Mark, so. But yeah, I'll I'll do what I can. Sorry. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
traffic. Traffic everywhere. What did everybody think of the Manchester Christmas markets? Mark cleaning. It was very, very busy. Very, busy. very, very busy. Mum's been busy. Yeah, it was borderline so busy you didn't really enjoy it, I think. Mm. Yeah, yeah. But, you know, we can say we've done it. We have. I think it would have been nice. I think it would be nice to come here one time and ice skate. Anybody want some? It would have been nice to have come here if we hadn't done the hollies as well. Yeah, we've so maybe little, we've maybe pushed the boat bit, out and done a little, little bit too much. <laughs> I think it would a be tour nice. Tour of Manchester today. Aren't we? Yeah, I think it would actually be nice as well so to we see had, the markets in the day. Felt like we had a little bit more time and not so rush. Come on tired. then, let's go. Oh, oh, we're already off. Right, okay. <laughs> so now, just to let everybody Put know, put my uh, lights on. Careful. Careful. Um, does anybody else's parents enter their car and no matter how long they've been driving, yeah babe, I can read the sign, don't you worry about it. Um, actually, should I go out here? Yep, That's why it says exit. Mm, that, it does. Yeah, well, he's just gone to drive on. Um, yeah, does anybody else's parents do this and they enter the vehicle of the car and they're like, no matter how long you've been driving, oh, careful, oh, don't do that. Um, because that's you guys. I love how she's like taking control and you're holding it for me. I am, because it's going to come off otherwise. It is. I need to get a car mount. I need to get a car mount. But for now, um, we're going to go to Hayhurst, which is my favourite ever, ever, ever pub. Pub? Restaurant? English pub restaurant? Gastro pub? I filmed before in there um, when I came with Harriet. So I'll show you it when we get there. But um, yeah. See you when we're there. We're here. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> Ready for on, bed? We on the front where the Christmas decorations are. I know. Are. Should we go in the front? Yeah. We always go in the side. Should we go in the front for a change? If you can. Luke's oh. here, by the way, everybody. Hi. They haven't got any lights around here. Oh, well, oh, one minute. I'll show you at the front. Here we go. Stay Look. Stay Look. Okay. Um, got there Everybody's back. talking, but just appreciate the tree. And appreciate imagine this in the summer like you can sit here in the sun and then overlook this as like all greenery but you can't obviously you can't see it at night but yeah this is it look at that oh, oh god he's already making a mess but yeah this is it this is the food come out like delicious hello um i promised you a haul um it is a couple of days later. Oh, I've got nature my nose. It is a couple of days later. Um, my hair looks gross. It's the end of the day. But I promised you a haul, so we're gonna do it. I thought I'd sit in front of the fire. It's kind of Christmassy. Let's go. I think I'm gonna start with the lights. No, I'm gonna end with the lights because I'll need a plug. So let's go with the first thing that isn't really Christmassy. This is the first item. Not really that Christmassy. It's a vase. I guess you would call it a vase. We're going to put a candle in it. So I guess you could kind of do with it what you wanted. But this, these first things were all from the Hollies, which is where we went first. And I actually thought of this kind of more for after Christmas, but this room is kind of green. Uh, I will show you in a minute. We got some new Decineo prints. Decineo, Decineo never know how to say it, but we got some new prints, um, a little bit like a video that I filmed quite a while ago now actually, um, where I did my room, we've done down here as well, but I'll show you them in a bit. The next thing we got was this, which is like a little boot, I guess you would call it a boot, a stocking, um, it's really cute, and we have like a light tree i will also show you that but we have like a tree which has all glass ornaments on so stuff like this and um stuff like this so this is the other one that we got to go on the light tree and if you can tell that little letter that she's holding is a little less very cute very self-indulgent but there is kind of like a reason behind this she was the only one on the shelf um, all the other fairies were either completely plain, they were just like the one that we already have, so she was just completely glass, or they had this like frosted detail, but they didn't have the little S, so we thought we had to get, well, 
I kind of was like, guys, we have, just so you're aware, we have to get that because it it's an S and she's iconic. So yeah, that was the second one. They're the two, ooh, my phone is not on silent. They were the only two glass ones we got. Then the rest of the baubles are all to go on our real tree. Our theme is red, gold, and green. Very traditional, red, green, and gold. Uh, however, we have loads of green, loads of green baubles, but not that, well, hardly any red and a couple of gold. Um, what I actually did, this might be like a pro tip, I don't know, but what I did before we went shopping for baubles, I took pictures of the ones that we already had. So we knew kind of, obviously you can see there, this is the amount of green we had in comparison to red, in comparison to gold. So we were really short on the reds. So that is mainly what we have in here, um, but I'll get them all out and then go through them. I actually just love this time of year. Like I love videos like this with people unwrapping presents or unwrapping the baubles that they have or showing like decorating the house. Oh, I just love it. I just love it. So I've unwrapped all the baubles. They're pretty much all red um, because like I said, they were the ones we needed. But we did get one gold one, which was this. I'm gonna say the name of them, but I don't know if that's helpful at all. It says floral silk Christmas and it was 3.49. That's the label on it. And then that's the bauble. So it's like I say, this gold color with then this sequin detail, leaf detail. And then it's on the top and on the bottom. But yeah, that's the that's one gold one. And we have a green one, which is very similar to that. The first two we got were these just like generic red ones, but they're matte. I don't know if that comes across on camera, but they're matte. And these were just 175 from, they say Christmas decorations on them i don't know that's the label if that if anybody wants matte baubles <laughs> but they're really nice and we just got two we got two of these and then two of these next ones which again were 175 these were the next ones which like i showed were kind of a more you can see yourself i just realized uh they're more of like obviously like a maroony red rather than a bright red the reason we got those was in to integrate these so i don't I'm gonna hold them all up at once, but then I'll show you them one by one. These like more maroon red ones. I really like the color of these. It's very like looks. It doesn't really come across on camera the red that they are. They're, maybe if I hold them next to this. Can you tell the color difference? They're more of like a darker red. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> um, but these were from Giselle. Gisella Graham? I have no idea, but there you go. They're like this lovely sparkly and I really like the shape of this one. And then we've got two of these, which are exactly the same brand, exactly the same color and everything, but more of a pear, no, rounded. I'm really not describing these very well. But you can see the difference there. You can see this one's like long and more elongated and that one's more rounded. But then I just really like how it kind of has that teardrop shape in adverse to like just being round. So they are all the baubles. Then we also got this just to kind of make the bottom of the tree. I think these are literally everywhere. This is actually from Aldi um, and was 15 pounds. Um, we did see one in the Bents Garden Center, uh, which we went to the second, which I didn't really film much in there, but they were 25, so a whole 10 pound saving. Um, and it literally looks exactly the same. If anything, I liked this one. The ones in Bents were like a lighter wicker, whereas I liked, we like this color. Um, and then the final, I think the final thing is the lights. So I'm pretty sure I showed these. I'm not sure, but let's show one on. Okay, so the lights might have changed a little bit because <laughs> I had to plug unplug one for this. This is the light in question. It's really self-explanatory. It's a star. Um, but then obviously it has this like hanging light section and then it obviously goes to just the wire that plugs in the wall. But we are thinking for the middle of the windows. So obviously we've got 
one window, two window, three window, four window, and then have like this star in each of the windows, which I think will look really, really cute. But yeah, this is what we got. And that, I think, is the last thing. Before I forget, I'm gonna show you the wall. This is the gallery wall. Um, we do have some lights on, but if I turn them all off, then you won't see the gallery wall. So yeah, uh, just ignore, ignore. Um, but this is it. Uh, it's kind of Christmassy, but we said, you know, some of them, so that one and this one up here would obviously stay, and then maybe even this one, and then because of the stag up there matches, we have like stag cushions. Um, but obviously we just changed these three, but they were like from the holiday collection, so they were a bit cheaper anyway. Um, so yeah, and this really satisfyingly is like a perfect match to the wall. And then this is the tree I was telling you about. I think you could get away, these ones are dead I, I love these. We literally bought these the other week. Um, they're actually from um, B and Q. They're like a really thin glass, and then it's like a teardrop at the bottom. But I feel like you could get away with this being absolutely empty of the other baubles and just have those on because they do give a really nice like raindrop effect. Anyway, I really like them. Um, this is like the angels I was talking about. They all look like that. We have some like pearlescent ones. And then some kind of, I don't even know how you would describe this, like orb ones. But they just reflect the lights really nicely. Um, these are the trees. Is there anything else I'm missing? I don't think so. But yeah, little snowman guy up there. The angel basically was hanging up here. And I think the sock was in here somewhere. But yeah, that's the tree. And I know it's really high up. Like if I stand back. It's the same, like if you sat down, the tree is all the way up here, but it really does fill the room and looks so Christmassy. I love it. There we go. That's the video. The fire is actually going out, but I'm not mad because I'm sweating um, sitting in front of it, but uh, it's still popping. Do you popping? Uh, also, I had my Spotify wrapped today. Like, you know, the, the thing where it tells you what you've been listening to the most. Jiggle, jiggle by Louis Theroux was third. Am I ashamed? No, no I'm not, no. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a really cute, wholesome, family, Christmas, Christmas market vlog type thing. I don't know, I don't know what I'm saying, but I loved this video and I hope you did too. If you did, please leave me a like down below and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you next week for another video. Bye for now.